Okay, to wrap up the show, let me tell you a little bit about how I did this technically. Uh, one of the things that um, was a great influence on Frank Zappa was the classical composer Edgar Varese. And one of the big things about Edgar Varese was his um, theory of organised sound. Now, in classical terms, that meant flutes with uh, trumpets and then strings with percussion and the like. And you organise certain sounds and organise certain pitches in a certain kind of way, and then away you go. Frank Zappa thought the world of Edgar Varese. Um, Varese is mostly thought as the mad professor of 20th century classical music. What does this have to do with the show? Well, because it's a Frank Zappa show, um, I'm talking about one of Frank Zappa's greatest influences. And what I've done with organized sound is I've taken my triggers on the drum set, which you can see there on the top of my tom-toms and everything there. Some of my even homemade ones from the local electronic shop. And it gets a bit too expensive. Uh, and what I've done is I've actually organized a computer patch sound from good old garage band, which I'm sure a lot of you out there have uh, got on your computer. Uh, and what I've done is I've triggered various sounds to various drums. So I'll hit a tom-tom and I'll get a drum, snare drum roll. I'll hit a snare drum and I'll get a cowbell. I'll hit a high tom and I'll get a, a light snare drum or a high snare drum and so on it goes. And um, that's what the um, theory of organized sound is all about. And that has got a lot to do with Frank Zappa's uh, style of composition as well. Uh, one of the other things that I've tried to do tonight is uh, explain the fact that you're pushing rhythm against rhythm. We know that as a polyrhythm, two separate rhythms played at the same time. Things like five against two, five against three, seven against three, seven against four, and on it goes. It takes a hell of a lot of work to master. The black page being the pretty much the piece of music. You can play that, you can play anything, which is what something that I say a lot. So I hope you get something out of the show. Here's a little bit more, and I'll come back in a little bit and wrap the show up for you.
Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed the show. It is all about Frank Zappa. Uh, my name is Chris Quinlan. If you'd like to contact me, it's melbournemusos at hotmail.com. If you'd like to check out all the extra bits I couldn't fit on the show, it's on YouTube slash Melbourne Musos. And uh, there's my website, which is also melbournemusos.net. Okay, so December 2013. Uh, Frank Zappa month for me, okay, 20 years since his passing on to the great gig in the sky, as Pink Floyd put it, and um, his last great tour, as his family put it, and uh, I just want to spend a little bit of time remembering the work and the legacy of this great man, Frank Zappa, okay, I hope you've enjoyed the show, and I will see you next week, take care, bye.